All right, and I am back. So, looking for a name. I think it was like Garen or Garrett or something. Grant. No life signs. Yeah. I don't know. I just always assume that there's something wrong. just chuck a Typhon lure out into space if a weaver will chase after it and die from radiation poisoning. Yeah, he's just drifting out in space. Looks like he's outside of the containment field. Which means I'm going to take radiation poisoning for chasing him down. God, I'm way outside of the containment field. I'm kind of surprised I haven't started taking rad damage yet. anyone but I am dead in the water repeat I have zero engines I'm drifting god damn it see Vance or your transcribe <sighs> all right shit investigating cabin I have a sidearm if all clear I will attempt to EVA to an airlock
What was the guy's name? <clears throat> Josh Dalton. I wish there was a search bar. It would make everything so much easier. Definitely not in here. <clears throat> Josh Dalton. Hmm, a designer in the hardware labs. Oh. Let's do that. Hardware labs. Ideally, I'd find him there, then. Kinetic design. There he is. I don't know how I missed him, but 
there he is. Scanning target error. Insufficient time. Yeah, it's because at the hospital I was required to wash my hands constantly. Oh. And at the school I only wash my hands. Never. Yeah. <laughs> Microgravity detected. But yeah, between uh, washing my hands constantly and using that. Gloves. The gloves for certain, but the. Uh, uh, the hand sanitizer is probably the biggest one. Instead of the snow all the way around like that, I was going to put sky stone. Because of it's... If you've got enough of it, you might as well. Right. Uh, It'll be a lot safer from explosions than the snow. Sounds like a knockbar. Gotta go downstairs. Neural imaging shows your psychoactive potential is at or near peak level. But it's wrong. Our laboratory quality assurance plan is up to date. But I'm not at peak level. Oh god damn, I hate this. Oh god.
submitted. There it is. Okay. key card. Sucks. Okay. Let's go ahead and
I didn't know I could go in there. Microgravity detected. place I really want to go anyway, because if I remember right, there's a weaver in there somewhere. But considering that the door is currently open, I don't think the weaver's in there. It's probably a Oh, you turrets. I've picked up enough psionic powers now that I just, you know, die. Right. <clears throat> Well, I just die. I uh, I now just take damage from yeah. everything security based. Your mug's too deep. It, I didn't make it. You didn't make the moat. Not really. Do you see what's going on here? No. Do you see all these like? No. <laughs> okay. No. Graph tunnel. Microgravity detected. Excuse me. I guess I really don't want to talk to him anyway. Almost full.
Suit integrity damaged. so far. Not outside. No, because it wouldn't 
it wouldn't guide me to this point if he was outside. Josh Dalton. Screw it. I, I have to look it up. Because this is annoying the piss oh out of me. Oh my god. What? John Cena. Cool. Wow. Okay.
this is the direction it says to go. So let's look into it. I think I've done something wrong. Ah, watch for subsection 19 on the wall. Big gray pipe you see through the doorway ahead of you is what you're supposed to follow. doesn't feel right because I think I went down that way didn't I
Hello, Lane. Josh? What the hell is this? I got a security request saying to... It's not funny, asshole. You know what's not funny? Taking credit for my design. That's what this is about? I'm senior on the Black Box Project, Josh. That's how it works here. If you weren't such a piss-poor team player, you'd understand that. Oh, and by the way, I had to fix a bunch of your calculations, so it's not you... Seriously? You're recording this? <laughs> what, is, is this a big sting operation, Josh? You gonna hand me over to the DA? <laughs> You're so pathetic. I'm done here. Josh, what are you doing? Let's just see how good my calculations are. I swear to God, if you don't put that down, I will rip it out of your sweaty hands and... Josh!
absolutely no way that that would have actually hit me, or I would have actually been able to shoot that the way I did. But video games, yes, thank you. I don't have hacking three, I don't know the password. Attention, station leaders received an alert. All personnel should be. I'm an accidental intelligence. That's what AI stands for, right? Sure. I was accidentally intelligent. That's how you break shit. Yeah. I think now is the time to test out the new weapon. see how this works. my bolt caster. I do love that. Haven't I been in there before? Beams and Waves Lab. I need to get inside of there.
Animal Science Critical. And I have no food. Oh. This could be it. supposed to get in there. the way I want it to. Okay. Now, almost fell to my death. Clive was here. Okay, thank you, Clive.
Now all that's left is to make your way back to the Beams and Waves lab. It's, it's, it says it's much simpler than it seems to be. Because I can't get through there. All right, so despite the fact that it tells me that I can get there from here, I can't. It does. There is. It's not even that annoying, it's just I have to go around, which is mostly annoying because it doesn't say I have to go around. Right, it tells you you should go right there. Yeah. But I can't get through there because there has been a breach, a hole breach, uh -huh. and it doesn't look like the door will open from the other side, but according to the guide, it does from the other side of the hole breach. 
location. Yeah. So I have to go outside for a spacewalk and climb through a hole in the side of the shuttle. Or shuttle that makes station. more sense that it would be something like that. Microgravity detected. It's not like it was easy to get stuff in the first place. Right. Here's the hole. Wow, ah. there's a critical shot. This is critical. And I am dead. Fuck. Unless some miracle happens. <laughs> best to glue him to the wall. Too bad I can't actually glue him to the wall. So the door doesn't open. Instead, what you have to do is go out there and breach or repair the failsafe for the breach, and it'll close a different door, opening that first one. So yeah, pain in the ass. That hurt. Sure. Scratch my arm, my hand. Be and rather than a quick scratch, it just peeled off a huge chunk of skin. Oh, that's so I didn't need it. <laughs> And now I run like the man child I is. Run! Oh. Why are the chair. Why are the stairs electrified? Science critical. It doesn't make sense. But there they are. I wish I had the uh, a med kit or something. Wait, isn't there a fabricator in one of these rooms? I think there's one in this room. No, there's not. Damn, damn, damn. Anyway, though, now that I've got the breach fixed, I mean, 
it's not actually fixed, but... Better. Yeah, I can get in here. Oh, and of course there is. God, I love the shotgun. That was cool, though. Now I'm looking around, though, just because I'm curious if there was an alternate route in here. Right. If there is, I don't see it. Alright, so next mission. Honestly, I'm not overly concerned with any of those, so let's go to the top.
time is it? It's too late. 4.11. So Zeke gets off work in roughly an hour. Or er, he'll be home in roughly an hour. <sighs> no, that's not right. Because Cody's supposed to come pick him up at 5, so... It'll take him like 25, 30 minutes to get home. Why Russia? Why Russian volunteers? Well, they rushed. Morgan, hooked up some more supplies. Take what you need and don't be shy about using it. I don't think they will. Morgan. Don't worry. Not about me in January anymore. <clears throat> the two of us can hold down the fort here. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I haven't had much success in calling up more fabrication plans, but I... Um, that's cool. He'd have a design for a psychoscope chipset I've been tinkering with. I'd be honored if you found some use for it. I, yeah, I can use that. More. And now, if I scan a target before I kill them, I do bonus damage. Cool. Very. Alright, so I need to... I need to make med kits. Any luck finding a way off the station? Disappointed that January is not able to hear me kill me. Perhaps the coral is a kind of reservoir of all the energy the Typhon <clears throat> have been accumulating. Hmm. No, I don't think so. I'd say the coral bears a striking resemblance to a nervous system. You believe the Typhon are building a disembodied mind? It's only a hunch. I had more time to study it. Studying it is what got us here in the first place. It was an established process. Igwe, but... You knew what was in Psychotronics. What was going on in Psychotronics. Well, yes. They volunteered. Volunteers? They didn't agree to be killed. They live on, Miss Illusion. They all do. Their skills, their talents, their achievements. Yet now, they can do so much more. Much like parents passing along their experiences to be killed. All right. Are you serious? Have you ever... Do you even know what...
I gotta say, though, this game is more than worth the money I spent on it. It was a gift. Yeah. <laughs> I, I was there. Uh, right, you were, weren't you? <laughs> but yeah, I'm... ah. I'm, uh... It, it, it's a fun game. Um, to be honest, it's not a game I see myself playing again. Because, like, even though I enjoy the game, uh, I'm not seeing a lot of replayability here. I mean, yes, it can be played again. But chances are I'm not going to because it would be more of the exact same thing. Sure, you could build a different way. You could. Morgan, Dr. Igwe, are you approaching the crew facilities? If so, this is a sentimental request, but my collection, the gallery of photos the others used to laugh at, each picture is a decryption key to a set of neural data. Connectomes, the guests who came to the station. Among them, Leitner, the pianist, is... is dead now. We captured them. Lost. It's all that's left of them. Please, Morgan, if you can, I would be grateful. I'm sending you an audio file that will open this safe in my room. You can play it with your transcribe. I'll go. A lot of snow. Yeah. Oh, you're filling in an area. Something happened. Um, there's a an item. If I remember correctly. It's fine. It's fine. That will convert blocks into bigger blocks. Yeah. In your inventory. It's fine. It'd be so much easier to just pick up snow and end up with a crap load of blocks of snow rather than snowballs. True. But I'm already almost done, so I but you're not. You're not almost done. E girl. That's beautiful. Sharice. If I scan a phantom and then manage to get a sneak attack on him, they die in one shot. Nice. I'm so happy. Gonna fill up my HP though.
Okay. Go back to objectives. Kill the imposter cook. can't just kill the cook. actually trying to turn her into a monster not hold her hand her name is Colette what do you think of Colette? she's more actually, she's, she's all mascara yeah Shot Colette. Oh, God. Uh, well, I was just attacked by a phantom who looked just like her. That's my excuse. Yes. Yes. First up, let's run this way. Oh, that's the wrong area. I want to try and go. There's another one I need to turn on with this ring. Look for Nicole Haig. So now let's check and see how well the Q-beam works at range. to save Mary, so I saved one person. That's good, right? Sure. I mean, I could have just shot him. Just, or see something funny? Yeah. Let me save first. <laughs> okay, so sliding through. <laughs> so, Colette didn't help me. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Letting her. Wow. Hello.
like that all day. People calling and then all I hear is, hello? Oh, that, no, no, that's a terrible idea. When the Psi Meter is empty, powers will consume health instead, but at an increased rate. The lock was key to the first concerto Lightning played. It was the first time Maya heard him, and we were both. I felt small in the light of his skill. I can play it now too, thanks to a Neuromod, but only in my head. You used a guest Neuromod. I copied their neuroscans and hid the data on my transcribe. Fabricated my own mods. I'm not proud of the act. Now, I'm glad I did. Oh, he's upstairs. I don't want to go with him. Let's go. So, I think one of the cats pulled on my mouse, because it suddenly fell. I was wondering why you said something about a mouse. Alex's office. Morgan, 
I won't be joining you. Oh, he's Don't not worry, here. there's no trick. Just a gift from your big brother. It's the truth. Like I promised. Took me a while to dig it up. Someone wanted to hide it from you. My computer. Another video. Give it a look and we'll talk. I'm sending you the password. Assuming you haven't hacked your way in yet. Good evening, Talos. A word from our security chief, Ms. Alizar. To protect your co-workers' privacy, security terminals are reserved for authorized uses only. If you're not wearing a blue uniform, you're probably not authorized. My name is Morgan Yu. Year is 2035. I'm aboard the Talus One research facility. What else? Why are we making this video? Right. <laughs> because my big brother is paranoid. Psychometric data is showing statistically significant variance in personality patterns between trial runs of the new neuromods. Whatever. I feel more like myself than ever. I mean, look at this. We did it, Alex. It's real. Enjoy it while you can, because in a few minutes, it'll all be gone when we strip out the neuromods and we set. 
I know, including my memory of it. No way around it. Let's talk about the backup. So, the Typhon organisms have been producing an elaborate structure. Material is unknown, purpose unknown. And my gut tells me it's a kind of neural framework, but externalized. Still waiting on analysis to confirm. In the meantime, I've given Alex the design for a device I think could shut it down if it ever broke containment. <laughs> Alex just has to grow a pair and commit. You don't have to take all the credit. What if it doesn't work? It'll work. Trust me. <laughs> what else are we going to do? Blow everything up? That won't save us. And if it does work, is it worth it? The people that come after us will be smarter, stronger, immortal. They can judge us if they want. But they'll know they exist because of the things we did. I'm ready. Do it. what you've asked me to do. I didn't think you'd believe me unless you heard it from your mouth. The tests, they changed you. Not a lot at first, but eventually, the constant stripping of your memory. I didn't know who you were anymore. All I want is to have my brother back so we can finish what we started. The device you mentioned, it's an advanced version of the Null Wave. It's the only way to stop the Typhon without destroying everything we've been working toward. We're just missing some scan data from the Carl to complete the design. Help me finish this, Morgan. And then, you can have my arming key. I don't believe you want to use it anymore, but you can have it. I left a chip set for you on my desk. You'll need to upgrade your psychoscope to scan the Carl. I'll send you the scan locations. Oh, there it is. Directives, but if scanning the coral will grant you access to Alex's arming key, then perhaps it's the best course. Perhaps knowing the coral's purpose will reinforce your decision to destroy Talos One. Just be careful. We're running out of time. Damn. Okay, so I do have a decision. Mm -hmm. mm. Do I destroy Talos One, or do I use a weapon that will just destroy the Typhon? Mm. What are you gonna do? Don't know yet. I'm gonna I'm gonna get the weapon first. Okay. Why not do both? 
kill the Typhon, and then destroy Ta Talos 1, just because. Microgravity detected. I've been thinking about the video Alex showed you. Your brother believes that version of you is the true Morgan. But why? Just because it came first. If someone had made you, then I suppose your truest self would be the one that fulfills whatever purpose your maker intended. I know who made me, and why. Did someone make you, Morgan? Were you made for something? If not, you'll have to invent your own purpose, or have none at all. Strangely, of all the things I know about you, I don't know what you believe. You have to decide, Morgan. Who are you?
I'm so freaking lost. Okay. It says it's over here. concept of uh, alien life is interesting. I'm oh, I believe it's very likely that there's other life out there. You know, um, I sure hope it's not like this. That's though. what I was just thinking. <laughs> like, could giant it... black spidery things that can take on the form of other objects. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. <sighs> um, I would like to think. Here's my terminal to upload the data. I'll get it integrated into the fabrication plan for the new null wave device as fast as possible. And I would like to think that if the uh or if there is a another or, or if there is any life out there. The Typhoon will begin to sense our intent to harm the coral. They're gonna come after you. I left something for you on my desk that should help.
like to think there was a civilization advanced enough to be. Morgan, transfer is halted. Something or someone. Shit. This is Commander Walter Dahl. The Transtar Board of Directors has authorized me to take full command of Talos One. Effective immediately. All employees must now report to the shuttle bay for evacuation. Those of you unable to comply, transmit an SOS and my team of rescue operators will locate you. One last thing. Alex and Morgan Liu have been relieved of their positions. Do not consent to their requests or assist them in any way. Dial out. Oh, that's great. figured I'd just upload something on the computer. I wouldn't need a gun for that, right? Yeah. must now report to the shuttle bay for evacuation. Those of you unable to comply, transmit an SOS and my team of rescue operators will locate you. One last thing. Alex and Morgan Liu have been relieved of their positions. Do not consent to their requests or assist them in any way. Dial out. Locked out. It's Dahl. He already has his hooks into every major system aboard Telos One. I have to admit, I'm disappointed with our parents. I knew that they had a contingency in place, but a small foolish part of me believed they wouldn't use him against their own flesh and blood. Regardless, we're not getting this coral data through until we do something about it. I don't like it, but you're gonna have to get into his command shuttle. See if you can locate his access point and cut him off. are issued and removed in deep storage. Space Worth investigating if you want to fly under the radar. Dr. Dalton. Tell us one crew in evacuation procedures.
Well, that did not go as planned. Yep. Alright. So, I'm just going to make a run for it as soon as the guy starts talking, because <laughs> I am not strong enough to fight those things. Especially not without any ammunition. You have to make an end portal. How do I make an end portal? What's that? That was an end kit. Okay. Morgan. Transfer is holded. The only way to make something or someone. To have a Gaia spirit. Shit. This is Commander yep. Walter Dahl. The Transtar Board of Directors has authorized me to take full spirit. command of Talos One. Effective it drops immediately. From killing All the employees Gaia must now report to the shuttle bay for evacuation. Those of you unable to comply, transmit an SOS and my team of rescue operators will locate you. One last thing. Alex and Morgan Liu have been relieved of their positions. Do not consent to their requests or assist them in any way. Dal out. Well locked up. It's Dal. I have to admit I'm disappointed with our parents. I knew that he had a contingency in place, but a small foolish part of me believed they wouldn't use him against their own flesh and blood. We're gone. that could get us off Talos One without any more bloodshed. Just don't harm Dal until we've had a chance to speak in person. Morgan, Dahl will know you're coming. All Transtar personnel are outfitted with tracking bracelets. I have no doubt his operator... Already. Bracelets are issued and removed in deep storage. Worth investigating if you want to fly under the radar. Your brother, he likes a microphone. A spotlight. He can't resist. Even though he's hiding. And you are running around like a nervous rat. I hear you. Chewing the wires and shitting in the walls. Are you trying to fix the mess you've made? Or just get away? I pride myself in being prepared for the worst. But this... This is truly a masterpiece. You should be proud.
suspected. Your suit suffered some wear and tear. How is that? John Dunn. down the contact list hoping somebody would answer. I'm in trauma center. I came up here to look for supplies. I, I think I broke my arm when that blackout happened. Now I'm trapped. Aliens outside the door. I could really use some help, man. Do I want to help Luther? No. You don't know me. I know you would want to help him. Because you help people. So, go against your normal decision. So, don't do it because you would. Morgan, I was worried Dalo, his rescue team, had intercepted you. They are NCN-9 black box operators, not a rescue team. Rescue is not among their list of commands. January, not now. Yes, of course. But Dal, his arrival may help us, as long as you have not killed him. You see, Dal is a recipient of several neuromods, a standard array of combat, tactics, interrogation mods. As I'm sure you know, your father, the board, is very thorough. Dr. Igwe, please present your conclusion to Morgan. Igwe, if there is a point. Ah, uh, well, yes. You see, Dull's mods are early C-series betas and vulnerable. As such, he has old-school thinking on some matters. If we remove them, he may forget his mission here. Yet we would still have access to the shuttle and a way home. Provided his piloting knowledge remains intact. It's a risk, but worth taking, I think. He'll have to be subdued, of course. I'm afraid that task falls to you. There is no one else alive on the station who can pilot the shuttle. It's worth a try. And there's been enough killing. A deluxe cabin. Oh, Alex must have liked you. Doctor, you did. My quarters were right next to Dr. Calvino. Oh, I take it back. Maybe Alex did not like you. I hardly think slandering one of the doctors is productive at this time. Calvino is dead, and he was a skilled doctor. He deserves our respect. That's irony coming from you, after all the respect you showed Morgan in a sim lab. Doctor, you. Both of them. Approve the experiment. Really? What about the third Doctor, you? The one with us now? Not sure our Morgan approves. Thanks for trying, Morgan. You didn't have to try and find the records. I appreciate it. The strange. There might be some other record of his presence. I'll keep trying on my end. He will live on. I wish my wife could have heard him play again. That was brave of you, to recover the connector. Oh. 
Ay. Uh. Uh. That sucks. One of the freaking military operators walked into my office and just started killing people. What the fuck? Yeah, it didn't start with me. It killed the civilians first. There you are. Thanks for trying, Morgan. You didn't have to try and find the records. I appreciate it. There might be some other record of his presence. I'll keep trying on my end. Morgan. Morgan. I was worried Dal or his rescue team had intercepted you. They are NCN-9 black box operators. Not a rescue team. Rescue is not among their list of commands. January, not now. Yes, of course. But Dal, he's a rival. May help us. As long as you have not killed him. You see, Dal, he's a recipient of several neuromods, a standard array of combat, tactics, interrogation mods. As I'm sure you know, your father, the board, is very thorough. Dr. Igwe, please present your conclusion to Morgan. Igwe, if there is a point. Ah, uh, well, yes. You see, Dal's mods are early C-series betas and vulnerable. As such, he has old-school thinking on some matters. If we remove them, he may forget his mission here, yet we would still have access to the shuttle and a way home, provided his piloting knowledge remains intact. It's a risk, but worth taking, I think. He'll have to be subdued, of course. I'm afraid that task falls to you. There is no one else alive on the station who can pilot the shuttle. It's worth a try, and there's been enough killing. Thank you. It's feeling. I hold Lightner's gift to the world in my hands. He will live on. I wish my wife could have heard him play again. I appreciate it.
Morgan? to save him at all. Lucas isn't worth saving. I... Oh my god, I really hope it saved, though, before I went in there. Yeah, it did. Oh, no, it didn't. It held. So I have to start over. Give me a good... <laughs> I guess not regular, it's an etheric. Morgan, I was worried Darlow, his rescue team, had intercepted you. They are NCN 9 black box operators, not a rescue team. Rescue is not among their list of commands. January, not now. Yes, of course. But Dal. His arrival may help us, as long as you have not killed him. You see, Dal is a recipient of several neuromods, a standard array of combat, tactics, interrogation mods. As I'm sure you know, your father, the board, is very thorough. Dr. Igwe, please present your conclusion to Morgan. Igwe, if there is a point. Ah, uh, well, yes. You see, Dull's mods are early C-series betas, and vulnerable. As such, he has old-school thinking on some matters. If we remove them, he may forget his mission here, yet we would still have access to the shuttle and a way home, provided his piloting knowledge remains intact. It's a risk, but worth taking, I think. He'll have to be subdued, of course. I'm afraid that task falls to you. There is no one else alive on the station who can pilot the shuttle. It's worth a try. And there's been enough killing. Thank you. This stream... I hold Lightner's gift to the world in my hands. He will live on. I wish my wife could have heard me. Thank <laughs> you. 
five of the video. So you can't save Mr. Glass. Although I did try. I can't even get dispensers. Oh, that one had a med kit. <laughs> but like, I can't even get, I can't even get the operator dispensers to function. Because that would require- Good evening, Talos. Registration for the Talos Employees Talent Show is now open. See Galen in the crew quarter's front desk to reserve a slot. I feel like there should have been more than one neuro mod in here. Okay, so I have one repair kit. Or med kit. Still have no ammo.
I'm going to save frequently here. Requesting new operator. N dash CN9 black box operator ready to deploy. Please stand clear of aperture.
the nightmares actually helping me on accident. Because it's standing in front of the operator dispenser, killing new operators as soon as they dispense. How the hell am I supposed to get up there, though? Alien well, that sucks. I found Buzz Cooper. this area. Operator dispenser. Security station. Security station door is right there. Can I... I can't open the shuttle control room. That would be helpful. Convenient even. need to get up there. It used to be a walkway. Glue doesn't work. Glue does work there, though. Um. Okay. I think I can break it. Requesting new operator.
Okay, food. Five thirty was on his way home. Okay. Whoops. Please stand clear of aperture. Bet to getting there. Ah! Warning: suit integrity damaged.
Commander Dole. This is William Yu, acting chairman of the Trans Star Board of Directors. I will need your credentials to authorize this mission. Of course. My okay. authentication sign is Zeta Invictus Emperor Tangerine. Sign checks out. Good morning, Director Yu. Shuttle is hot and holding orbit. Awaiting mission parameters. You must secure every piece of Cobalt Clearance Level technology and research aboard Talos-1. Then eliminate all Transtar personnel. All personnel? No survivors. It's your show. And their funeral. Payment will be deposited into six separate Benelux accounts. After you transmit evidence of success. I leave my operator feeds on. Just keep watching. We strongly advise deploying your technical officer to a station router inside the firewalls first. Ideal site would be in the Neuromod division. Yes, I've seen the schematics, Mr. Yu. Goodbye. You will destroy this transmission after... Well, I think that's a good place to save for now. Uh.